24. Did I make it in this time or the glitch got me? Uh, it seems to be there's no glitch. Yeah, that's good. Um, okay, so with like what? Okay, so right. <clears throat> so you say you think uh, sex and gender are different things? Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> well, like, okay, so if I go by that logic, sex is, you know, what you have, like your body basically. Sex would be biological what, characteristics, yes. And then what is gender? Like, how It would, would be I social explain? characteristics, so behaviors, yeah. uh, uh, psychology, uh, those type mm -hmm. of attributes, uh, cultural attributes, those make up gender. Okay, if, say, that social attributes or whatever went away, yeah, they kind of change because social constructs like they can change right they're, they're not like set in stone it's not by science correct uh well it is science it'd be the social sciences so sociology would be the science behind but it like could social all go things away. it could theoretically go away yeah as soon as humans go away it's gone it's subjective well, to, like, to humans okay so if i go by gender like of a woman like what i presume people would think of that would maybe be like i don't know someone who likes to wear makeup and like wear Girly clothes and stuff like that. Yes, this would be your this would be your own social schema around what 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 gender is and what the specific gender so you're saying, is. Okay, so for, so you're saying for females then with gender that it's a okay, but women like women are all all women are different like correct. So how is there one like accepted? Mm -hmm schema or social construct then if we're all different Th there's not schemas would be inherently personal you have different. a personal schema okay then and if it's all personal then um that means that uh, uh, that means that my gender would be different to a trans woman no nobody else can tell you what your personal schema is nobody else can make an identity claim for you okay but the thing is i don't understand if Gender is a social construct, yeah, that construct can be absolute. Uh, we could, but that could just be taken away. Then what would trans women have to like cling on to? What do you, what do you mean? It, what do you mean it could be taken away? away? It's only going to go away if people go away. But it can, but it can change. Social constructs can change. It's not set yes, in stone. Yes, they, they do change all the time. What, what it means exactly. to be a woman today is not what it meant to be a woman in the 50s. And even that's not it what it meant to be a woman in like 18, in the 1800s. Like these things change all the time. I mean, like, it's just, it doesn't like, like if I, okay, if my own social schema then of being a woman, no, if being a man is to have tits, that's, that should be accepted, right? If being that's a man is to have tits, I'm a man who has tits. I don't understand what the... Like, that's my schema. That's what I presume to be the gender of a girl, a man, is to have tits. That's okay. That's allowed. Yeah, that would be your schema on men. It doesn't mean that that makes all, all men this way. It just means have, that's like, how your brain is categorized men. Okay, but if we all have, like... Oh, God, let's get this topic, man. <laughs> It's, it's a lot, it's a lot. I just, I feel, I feel, what do we get by losing trans woman, woman? I feel like we, we lose like the, that we are different, that there are big differences between us. No, because you but would, if you were, no, if you were, hold on. If you were just describing the differences between a trans woman and a cis woman, you would then use the term trans and cis. But if you are not describing the differences between them, you would just call everybody a woman. Okay, so trans women, some people say that trans women are a type of woman. Um, they are. Woman is the is, umbrella term. Trans would be the term that, like, narrows yeah, it down. Yeah, someone says hey, there are differences between every woman. So, like, to me, tra trans women just kind of, I don't know, they see things maybe they relate to and what a woman does, whether that be makeup or, like, the way that, and then they just kind of say, well, I want to be like that and I'm a drag they light. relate to a so thing I'm a woman does woman. if a woman yeah. does makeup and then they yeah. do makeup would that make them a woman no <laughs> what would be the difference there then that, that they're not a woman what, what would be that what is okay so then I'll just ask you what is a woman 
a woman is who I am. A like I believe that sex and gender are intertwined, so that, that I am a woman. Every just FYI, every gender scholar would also agree that sex and gender are intertwined. They are an inherently linked thing in our brains. Uh, that's why gender identity is your perception of your uh, sex and the orientation of that sex, because it's how your brain links the two things. So yes, it's not. It's a perception. It's not science. It We're is, not the it same. Is, wait, gender identity no, is a, is a science thing. It exists in our brains. It's a neurological thing. Gender identity. Okay, but if we we all can like perceive women differently. Like what it means to be a woman differently. There's at least with sex argument, we we there's like actual facts. With the gender argument, there's just two, there's so many avenues you could go down. Anything could be have a gender at this point. No, only it humans just... have gender. Oh god. Oh my god. But gender is an inherently human what, thing. So to you then, if you believe that it's the same, what do you believe that? A, w a woman is genderly speaking. Uh, I would define a woman as anyone whose gender identity aligns with their social, their personal social schema on female. Okay, if my social schema is I'm a light bulb, is that all right? Light bulbs would not be a social schema. We why can't what's, why can't because light bulbs are not a social thing; they're an inanimate object. Social schemas describe social categories and social constructions. That's why I put the term social in front of the term schema. Okay. I guess it's just, I don't know. I, I mean, like, I, I accept that a trans woman can like stereotypically womanly things, but I think, what do you lose by calling trans women women? I think that we just got to keep, we have to keep, like, we, ha we at least have to know that they are, like, a trans. Like, we can't just accept that they are a woman because that that's not like factually all true so we, have, we, we need to uh, we have to know they're trans women but we can't call them women we we just need to know that they are trans that do you think that's important to know that to know if is somebody trans is trans not... no it's not important yeah, for me. Yeah. it might be important for their doctor but it's not important to me in any way shape or form but does it like it does, it's not gonna. It's not going to affect how I view that person. It's not going to affect how I treat that person. Not, so then, why is it important that we know that someone is trans? Because that way we 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 can we we know like who they are, like what 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 person type of person they are. Just what? like people. Make Wait, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What does them being trans change about the type of person they are? Well, the, the, or tra well, you literally trans women and all that about are all about self identity politics. So I'm I'm sure that they they should agree with that. They're all it's all about self identity with their gender. So all gender is a self identification. So, yeah, it's all how they want to be perceived. No, that's all gender. Not that's like gen that's what gender is. It's an identity. But like, so gender is an identity. Yeah. And is is something as simple as someone likes blankets in their bed? Is that gender? <laughs> Liking blankets would not be an identity. Do you understand what identities are? I'm not trying to run. I just know that, tra like, if, if, like, gender is a social construct, I know that social constructs are not set in stone, while well, sex is. So, yeah, like, gen like, social constructs are just, like, could be anything. So, yeah. Well, uh, I'm sorry. What do you mean by sex is set in stone? Sex is set in stone. Like, you, you either have the male body, well, body parts, or woman body parts that's set in stone there's n no one ever like yeah can change their body parts that's not true 
No, you can't change your body. Po uh, what you you you, yes, you, you that's set in stone. Like, I can literally pay if I have enough money, I can get a vagina. A wall? I don't want one, but I can. You can't what, get a wall. Oh, yeah, the other body part. Yeah, if I have enough money, I can get a vagina. No, you can't. Yes, I can. You can get something that may look like one, but it will never ever. What do you? Ever, what ever is a? Fall. What is a vagina? <laughs> they have a vagina is a vagina. What is it? You can't get one. What is a vagina? Like, like biologically speaking, what is this thing? The vagina is. I don't. It's a vagina, vagina. Okay, that's what it is. But you what, can't what get is one. It? Yes, yes. Anybody can get a vagina. No, you can't. You yeah. actually believe that? You they're believe called, that you they're called vaginoplasties? Yeah. You can't. I literally, okay. I've seen. I guess there's a lot to learn. They said, I don't under. I really find that hard to fathom that people believe that a man could just get a vagina. Like it's vaginas are quite literally just a, a a. I'm sorry. Where's the science to prove that a man can get a vagina? This is I've never seen vaginoplasties. This ever in my life. Vaginoplasties are the science. They're the procedure that are used to give men vaginas. That, that's not true. Now, I would agree if you were to say males can't be given uteruses. Currently, right now, we don't have the medical science to do that. No, a, vag a vagina is linked with all of that stuff. No, no a vagina is just a, like a, a opening. It's literally just like a vaginal. It's the vaginal canal. Now, now let me ask you a question. Let's say you have a. Let's say you have a cis. Hold on. Let's say. Let's say you have a cis woman who's born with vaginal agenesis. So she doesn't have the vagina. She doesn't have a vagina. She's born without one. And the doctors go in and perform a vaginoplasty and give her a vagina. Is that a real vagina? I don't know enough about this science. This science, but like this, what you're talking about. Like, uh, but uh, I know that a man can get a vagina. I just know okay. that. Okay. Do you no want to? Okay, do you want to answer the question or not? What, sorry, what the, what the, on the screen? If No, if a cis woman is yep. born without, mm -hmm. a vag, without a vagina because she has vaginal agenesis, which is a common thing amongst cis women. Okay, mm -hmm. so she's born without a vagina. I'd, I've never heard and of the, this. So oh, would... Just because you haven't heard of a medical condition doesn't mean it doesn't exist. But I can't, I can't like, give an accurate like, answer. To I'm explaining it all to you. Yes, you can. I'm literally explaining it no. to you. Vaginal you agenesis to... is when a woman can be born without either her reproductive organs or a vaginal canal. So she's born without a vagina. Okay? That's the, that's the condition. Okay? So she's born with vaginal agenesis, and the doctors go in and reconstruct and give her a vaginoplasty and give her a vagina. Is that vagina real? I don't, I don't know about this, so I don't want to answer. To Holy shit. <laughs> well, I don't want to answer. But I've literally explained it. I've literally so explained it all to you. A, can I get the other way Yes, now? it's can called I a phalloplasty, yes. And it's the, and it, like, what are you, like, and it meets, so it, it, does it function the same way as, yes. say, a man's rub? Oh my god, no. I don't believe this one. You would, you would urinate out of it. You can have sex with it. Yes. I, I can't believe, like, this hasn't been, like, on all the topics and debates I've seen on Google, this would be, a, like, a kind of a valid argument, but no one ever says this. What, do you, what do you think people talk about when they talk about bottom surgery? They're talking about either a vaginoplasty or a phalloplasty. Yeah, I've seen, like, trans women talk about it, and they literally have said it's just a bloody like hole that they literally have to stick stuff in all the time so it doesn't close up and get I all these, guarantee like, you you've never factors. met you've never seen a trans woman no, just I call think, it a yes, hole you have yes this, this, this literally what it is it's just bloody you, hole. what do you think a vagina is it's just a hole no but it's it's more than that no it's just like it's how just so a bloody hole. Like, there's I, i'm not a, like a good scientific person it's probably like nerves and all of this there are nerves I... there are nerves in a vaginoplasty as well oh god i'm not god damn anyway what why does yeah why does say a trans woman then sorry i won't stay on for long i'll go soon um what why does a trans woman if they're so sure of their gender why do they need to the sex stuff people save your embarrassment it's just because we have a different of opinion like i know that uh, okay 
Wait, hold on. This isn't a different. This just FYI. This isn't a different in a difference in opinion. You're actively ignoring science. But the reason no, why no, some no, trans no, people, the reason why, the reason, why, the reason hold on. are not science. Yes, they They're are. That's why we have an entire no. branch of science dedicated to studying them called sociology. It's it is not. an entire branch of science dedicated to studying social constructions. Yeah, so to and can change and yep like, yep doesn't make them not real social social construction of what a woman is is she likes to wear makeup do clothes she's that women are always very kind and stuff like that that can change so yep. if that's what a trans woman is identifying with that's their social schema it it, it the whatever they relate to could be taken away in a minute and then what would they still be a trans woman because they're the only one who like does all that it just doesn't make any sense yes their gender identity would still align with their social schema so they would still be women yes so it's whatever they like perceive to be a woman okay that's what all are. all gender is a perception based mm -hmm. thing but if we have different perceptions like there's no like yes hold on that. hold on can i ask you a question what do you think a friend yeah. is God. But like, oh, this is like. It's a relevant okay. question. I don't like to do makeup. I'm a woman. Yeah, that's because I'm assuming we have a. Like, Please answer the question and stop talking to the comments. Well, I don't. Okay, a friend. A friend is. <laughs> Why do I suck with these definitions? A a friend is someone who you speak to on the regular you're there for each other all of that jazz yeah what if i think a friend is something different what if to me a friend is somebody who you see occasionally a friend is somebody who you might email back and forth with you don't talk to them usually maybe like once a week or so but i think that's a friend does does that mean that the person you think is a friend is not your friend because i have a different schema on what a friend might be right okay yeah, I get, I get that, but then can I not have a social, can I have like a different social schema on any word then? Why is that just always gender? You can have a different it's, social it's, schema it's, on, it's, spe it's, on specific social constructions. You can have your oh, own is that, schema is that, on is that, is that set in stone? That well, we, just talk, we just talked about how you can have a different social schema around what a friend is than I might. So yes, clearly yeah, there are, there are different things. Then, what? Really? I can have a social schema around anything. Around specific that. things, yes. No, but where's what? Why only specific things? Because most some things are not social constructions, so you can't have a social schema about them. Mm -hmm. I I I don't know. I that have to do with social constructs. Okay, um. Oh, I just, it doesn't really, this, this stuff doesn't really make any sense to me. I don't, I don't hate, like, trans people. Like, I, I, I respect people as they, they are, but I just think, for my own sanity, I want to know who's a girl and who's a boy, but whatever you, you're into. But you can't like, even define I, for me what a girl or a boy is. Yeah, I'm a girl. Like, what's, don't what, invalidate what's me like that, because I am a girl, I'm a what woman, is that, this has what been does my that whole mean? life experience. What does that mean? What does it mean? It means that that's just who I am. Oh, I think it's just together. it's just who you are. Being a girl, being a girl, yeah. it's just who you are. It's oh, are, it's yeah. almost like for trans people, being a, for like a trans woman, being a girl would just be who they are. Wow, it's almost like you have the same exact criteria that trans people have for when they claim that they are the gender that they are. But okay, whatever. But at least, at least you can validate that we have like different, like there are differences between trans women and women. We're not the same. Yeah, trans women, trans women would have a gender identity differing from their sex, uh, while cis women would have a gender identity that aligns with their sex. Both are still women. Yeah, I just like agree with that, but. That, yeah, you disagree, okay. but you can't substantiate your disagreement in any like meaningful way. No, I can. My disagreement, I have my reasons for why I believe that, and it's still valid. Just as I guess you could say your argument to you is still valid. Well, I would disagree that your your reasons are valid. You would be no able to substantiate them. There's gonna be there'll be no way on God's green earth. Like I, I severely doubt that there will ever be a time 
where all politicians and everyone around the world will agree with what the trans people think is true to them. What the hell does that matter? Because, because like, you know, they, they like... <laughs> There was a time. There was a time where most people didn't agree if slaves should be freed or not. Does that mean they shouldn't have been? What do I care what most people agree with? Like what? Well, because well, I don't know. Like, you do not see like the tr trans people want to like go into the women's bathrooms, or they want to go into well, since, well, since, well, since trans women and stuff like since that. trans are women are things. women, I think they should go into the women's bathroom if that's where they feel most comfortable. Yeah, no, I, don't, I definitely disagree with that. What about prisons, then? I think it should be determined based on, like, a lot of mitigating factors when we look at prisons. Is the person violent? Are they dangerous? Are they this? Are they that? We should look at it the same way we look at whether or not we put cis people into the same prisons. Mm, no, but a cis, a cis person would go into, the, no matter what, they'd go into the same gender one, wouldn't they? Possibly. Mm -hmm. Or we put them into into like uh we don't put them into gen gen pop because they may be violent for instance if i have a cis woman who's going to prison because they I consistently can i finish if i have a cis Sorry. woman who goes into prison because they consistently r word other cis women i'm not going to put them in the general population with the other cis women i'm going to put them in somewhere else yeah they'd probably be somewhere where they don't get to like maybe be exposed to people that often to be able to partake in that. I don't think they'd be in a different... I don't think they'd be in a man's prison. I don't think that would ever happen. Yeah, I would never put a trans woman in a into a male prison either because it's incredibly dangerous for them. But could you... It could be dangerous for the women as well. You could say that's it as well. If, if a trans woman goes to jail for, let's say, check, check fraud... She writes bogus checks and she goes to jail for it. Why is she dangerous to the, to the cis woman in that prison? If she's never been in trouble for any sort of violence. She's inherently dangerous, but like you can't just like, you can't like pimp, like you can't just pick out specific crimes. I don't think that's. that's yeah, that's how that's we, what are you talking about? That's how we send people to prison. But they won't, but, but okay, you can't, <laughs> in, but in terms of gender, in terms of gender, I'm, I, I'm pretty sure a woman, a cis woman would never ever go into prison men depend on it uh, doesn't matter what crime she's done yeah because we gender prisons what, yeah, what does this have to do it's with anything it's not uh, these are, what, you say what does this have to do with anything but these are the sort of like topics that that come up against trans women and it almost almost I don't yeah and i've already answered we would either we would look at if this if this person needs to either go into uh, I would never send a trans woman into a cis man's prison. They would either go into protective custody in prison, or they would, go, or they wouldn't, and like not go into gen pop, or they go into gen pop in a female prison. Like, I'm sorry, I'm not. Trans women are at so much more risk around cis men. So no, I'm not sending them to a cis male's prison. I I don't think that's ever that's ever gonna happen, but. Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know. You seem to I not do, know I, a lot. I, well, I do know, but this stuff is like, I think, you know, like, this, this gender argument could lead people anywhere. It's, it's a joke. To anywhere like you. what? Anywhere like what? Well, what are I you afraid of? What are you afraid of? Afraid of? I'm, I think... I don't want to feel invalidated as who I am. Like, and I how feel does like I what do how does what other people identify as invalidate what when you they identify throw it in as? Your face, when they throw it in your face, where they make you seem stupid, like, oh my god, how can you not know that I'm a woman? And I'm like, well, you know, like my roots are kind of like the way that I believe is about this thing is clearly different to what you believe. But like, if it was very invalidating, it's like you don't accept that I'm a bloody woman, then you are crazy. Or this, this, that, and the other. And I, I would just... say I wouldn't say you're crazy. I'd say you're transphobic. Transphobic. Yes. So, so transphobic meaning I hate trans people. Transphobic meaning you invalidate trans identities. Whatever their identity is as a human, like a human being, is fine. But I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna display. Like, I'm not gonna then see this person who proclaims they're women, and if I know that they don't have the body parts, like in my head, you are not. A woman 
And that's that's that. Okay, so then a cis woman born with vaginal agenesis would not be a woman to you. No. Yeah, you, you said, said you said woman. if they don't have the body parts, they're not a woman. So if a cis woman is born with vaginal agenesis and does not have a reproductive it system, they're not a woman to you. Abnormality. It doesn't seem like they've got. You, then you don't know, the make it. Then don't make the claim that they have to have these parts. If the minute they don't have these parts, you still call them women. It's 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 literally you can't say that, that there's a necessary condition to being a woman. And then this minute that necessary condition is missing going, oh, they still have they're still a woman. That's so stupid. I just think sex is way more like rooted in truth than gender is. Gender is wishy-washy to me, so. Okay, well, A, gender is a social construction. There's no objective truth Which to a social has construction. No definit like has no definitive set in, like, ev everyone Yes, there is one. no objective no, truth people, to a social people construction. People in the chat will say that I am different to other women. I don't women, give so a shit what people same. in the chat say. Do you well, want well, to go talk to them, or do you want to talk to me? Oh, no, so, uh, uh, right, okay. <laughs> I'm just saying that a lot of women, like, you know, genderly, whatever, they, they, everyone has different opinion, like, 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 lived experiences of what they think a woman is. So there's no set in stone. Woman. Yes. That's why, wait, that's why in my definition, I say a woman is anyone whose gender ide identity matches their social schema on females because everyone has a different idea of what it is to be woman or what it is to be man. Think that's the point. There is no set in stone way to be a woman. That doesn't exist. Okay. Fair enough. But I just I for me personally genderly and um, gender and sex same thing to me. And I'm never going to like go off that bit doesn't mean I. Okay, you're hate wrong. Trying. <laughs> you can you claim gender me. yes 100 you can't validate yes me. yes i can i can invalid I can, no i can actually i can absolutely i'm cisphobic i'm cis stupid i'm cisphobic no, to myself don't dummy stupid dumb like, okay i'll call you dummy uh yes i can absolutely say when you say sex and gender are the same thing i can say no me. they're clearly not I don't care if I'm invalid. I don't. Yeah, I don't care if I invalidate you for saying something wrong. Well, that's okay. You said if I invalidate a trans woman, then I'm transphobic. So. Yes, if you invalidate their identity, I'm not invalidating your identity. I'm saying a. Fa uh, I'm saying that a factual statement you you claim to be making is not a factual statement. That's what I'm saying. That's not invalidating your identity. Are you dumb? No, I don't like this. Are you dumb thing? Like we have a different opinion. So yeah. Opinions can be wrong. I hate to tell you this. Okay, well, I believe I'm right. You believe you're right. Okay, so. you can believe you're right all day, but go open up go right. open up a biology textbook and tell me that gender and sex are the same thing. Go do it. I'd love to see it. What? Okay. Um. Um. I don't know. Well. Yeah, I didn't mean it. So I, I just, I'm always going to believe. The, but the thing is, I'm actually quite, um, like, like I'm, at, I'm, I think I'm quite empathetic to empathetic. Is that the word? <laughs> to towards the other side. I don't think you are. People believe, like at all. but I just believe different. Her opinion is based on hate. I don't hate anyone. Jesus. I, I think it's, I think it's very clear. Your opinion what, is you, is based on the fact that you it? don't understand the difference between sex and gender. I do, I do understand the difference between, but I think gender you don't, is wishy-washy, can change, gender can change, yes, gender can change, yes, no, gender, that's, yes, yeah, so that's the, the point, so it's wishy-washy, it could be anything, my gender is a ton of bricks, bricks wouldn't be a gender, to... yes it can be, no, bricks are yes, an inanimate an object, I don't think you understand what qualia is. Okay, my gender is some. Oh God, it's like it's just so. But like, okay, what's your like idea of a gender of a man then? And don't say whatever. So, yeah, what is your gender of a man? Explain. What do I think men are? Yeah. I think men are anybody who meet the typical social conventions of of masculinity in any given society. Is that the only definition of a man? 
That's the one I would use because you asked me what I would use. So that's what I would say a man is. That would be the characteristics. Those would be the characteristics that I would deem man. And what are they? So it would be typical masculinity dependent on the society you're in. <laughs> oh. I think I'm not really good at debating. I'm not really good at debate. But That's debating. clear. Like, I've def yeah. <laughs> well, I, I, I still have my opi like, opinions and what I believe to be facts. But what do you, what do you, like, before I go, like, do you, I, I'm, like, do you, um, have you seen, like, Jordan Peterson and stuff like that's views on that? Yeah, Jordan you know Peterson, Jordan Peterson is a hack. Is a what? A hack. What does that mean? It means he's an idiot. Jordan Peterson based what? half of his. Yes, Jordan Peterson based half of his like uh, academic career around an idea about lobsters that like is factually untrue, and he's based like most of his like uh, societal ideals around this this dumb lobster fact that again not true. What about do you know? Have you heard of Rishi like Rishi Sunak and what he said about this debate? No. He, he's like the UK prime minister and he basically was just like, I don't know why it's such a big debate. Like a woman is a woman, a man is a man. I agree. I a woman agreeing, is a woman, like, is a man is a man. I agree. I don't think he was agreeing with like the trans thing there. People yeah, because they don't understand. What does it mean? Like, uh, I think they mean uh, that you've embarrassed yourself multiple times with this live. I have, see, like, I haven't embarrassed myself for having views. Like, I don't, like, I could I could definitely say to a, a a man that comes into I don't know wherever I'm at and proclaims him he's a woman, I could say that's embarrassing and that is fair to me. So there we are. You think it's embarrassing when trans people exist? When a man with a PV complains he's a woman, to me, I'm like, right, okay then. Um, yeah. You think it's embarrassing? But, but you're saying happens. my views are embarrassing, so. Yes. Oh God, and I think that if you think of a man, a man with PP can be a woman, then I think that's embarrassing as well. Yeah, you I think trans people are embarrassing. That. No, I think your your opinion of that is embarrassing. You think that people that support trans people are embarrassing? No, I think your opinion is embarrassing. You or people yes, really want you, me to be. You like, think that people that support and validate trans people are embarrassing because you're transphobic, yeah. Oh my god, transphobic. I think you are You just you said are, if you <sighs> think a man with a pee pee is a woman, you're embarrassing. That would be a transphobic thing to claim. That would be actually a sensible I, I would respect you more if you just were like, Yeah, I'm transphobic and you just owned up to it. No, but you want me to seem like this hateful person towards people, but I just believe in a different... They believe you one thing and I believe the said, other. You just said... You just said, if a mm -hmm. trans... If you if you support a trans person, you're embarrassing. You just said that. No, I didn't actually say that. I said you I would... I don't know. I, I, you, you're trying you didn't to just say that? My, you were trying to call, like, my opinions... Opinions of the this embarrassing and saying yes, that opinions, everyone in the chat opinions can be that. embarrassing I, I don't care what the people in the chat agree with or disagree with i'm not talking to chat i'm talking to you opinions can be embarrassing opinions can be homophobic transphobic racist they can be all of these things right just because you have an opinion does it not does not make you devoid of criticism your opinion can be criticized mm -hmm. yeah so I, I was just giving it back you think my opinions are this and I think your opinions are this. Yes, I think your opinion is transphobic because it invalidates trans people and it can produce harm to trans people. You think my opinion's embarrassing because it supports trans people. So you're just proving my opinion that you are transphobic. Hmm. I don't, yeah. In transphobia, la 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 la. Oh God. Uh, sorry. <laughs> uh, I I don't want to be known as like someone that hates anyone. I just have different. I mean, maybe don't say hateful shit then. I don't think it's hateful. I just. You don't think it's hateful to say that it's embarrassing to support trans people? You don't think that's I never hateful? Said that. You said <laughs> if you think a man with a peepee -pee can be a woman, 
you are embarrassing. You said that. So stop saying you didn't say it and own up to what you said less than five minutes ago. I think it's not rooted in truth. And that's what I think. It's not rooted in truth. What you're saying to me is There is no objective truth in a social construction. So I, it can't, it physically, it's impossible to be rooted in any so sort of objective the, truth because it's a social construction. And if it's a social construction of no objective truth, then my social construction of my gender is I am a light bulb. And I can say that. There's no light objective truth. Light bulbs are not you can't tell so, me a no social thing. There's no light ob- bulbs truth. are not a social thing. They're light, light bulbs. bulbs. are very social things. No, they're, they're social. light bulbs. I don't I don't really know if I have anything else to say uh but yeah just just in in my eyes we're just difference of opinion yes your opinion is transphobic my opinion is in support of trans people it's cisphobic you must cisphobic how can I be cisphobic when I'm cis well exactly you look stupid now no, because you... Okay, you're cisphobic to me because... How can I be cisphobic when I am cis? You're invalidating cis? my... Oh, God. How can I... Am, am I saying that you can't be cis? Am I saying that? Am I saying that you're not a cis person? Okay, so I'm not invalidating you being cis. Can you just you're stop... Can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor and stop just trying to regurgitate shit that I say to make it seem like you can twist stuff back? Because you sound dumb when you do it. Oh, that's very nice of you. I just, I H, just, my, for the my, my beliefs will always be in the facts of what will make my life a lot simpler. So, if yeah. you are you joking? If you're, I'm just gonna let you know this right now, and I'm gonna let you know this as nicely and as calmly as possible. If you ever say the phrase, "My beliefs are gonna be rooted in what makes my life simpler," you are a piece of shit. You're you're a, you're a bad person. You're not a good person. It's Sorry. Always funny whenever not to grandstand, not to grandstand, yeah, but you're not a good person. It's always funny whenever I come on these sort of like debate things. Yeah, like it's always the person that doesn't believe with whatever thing you've got going on ends up being uh-huh. the horrible person. Uh-huh. I always end up being the no, bad guy. No, you are a bad guy because you just said the phrase. I'm going to believe whatever makes my life easier. That's what makes you the bad guy. It does make my life easier because if I go by what you go, I I, I just it I, I you have to you have to use different words. You have to use different language. Aw, I'm sorry. You have to use different language. You're so patronizing. Aww, it's really embarrassing aww, for you, actually. Aw, I'm so sorry. You have to use different. La- I'm so sorry. You have to use different words. Wow, that your life is so tough because you have to use different words. Your life is so hard. Yeah. I, we'll have to create. We'll have to create some type of some type of special award just for you for suffering so much that you have to use different words. You suffer so much more than the rest of us. I'm so sorry. I literally like feel like it's really sad that you're coming I'm, at me this way. I'm minute. so yeah. sorry. Your life is so hard. I, I'm so sorry that a lot of people don't mm-hmm. actually just agree with any of this stuff. I don't stuff. care if people agree with me or not. That doesn't mean anything. People agreeing with you doesn't make you right. There were also people that agreed with slave owners. Do you think that made slave ownership correct? No, I don't care if people agree with me. That doesn't mean anything. You care if you have to use hard words and you might have to open a book. So you're so brave. You're so brave. Yeah, you're very like mean, but that's all right. You're so brave. Yeah, I literally don't know what tangent you're going on. So. I'm going on the tangent of you claiming that you having to do anything that makes your life slightly hard, anything, anything when it comes to respecting other people and their identity, anything when it comes to that, if, if your life is, if your life is made even remotely harder, and by the way, the hard thing here is just you changing your language. That's what you think it makes your life so much harder is that you have to, you might have to change your language and use different language. So that makes your life so much fucking harder. The privilege it takes to make a statement like that is mind boggling. So yeah, I don't respect you. I don't respect your opinion. I do think you're transphobic. I do think you've said bigoted statements here. I think you are, you are trying to push it as, well, it's just my opinion to try to obfuscate your way out of the fact that you said bigoted shit. 
And so I don't care. Like, I really don't. You are a child. You're acting like a child. And then you're going to sit here and act like you're going to sit here and act like you're going to sit here and act like your life is so tough. Your life is the hardest thing in the world because you have to use different language. You said, you said, I'm going to agree. You said specifically, you specifically, exactly. You are specifically going to do things if they make your life easier. As long as your life is easy, as long as as long as Jess's life is easy, then that's all that matters for Jess. As long as your life is easy, that's all that matters. As long as you have an easy life, that's all that matters. Doesn't matter if trans people are being belittled for for who they are. It doesn't matter if people are using that exact same reggae. It doesn't. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if the rhetoric you use, it doesn't matter if the rhetoric you use is what's stripping trans people of their civil liberties and rights. None of that matters. All that matters is that you don't have to use tough language. That's all that matters. No, all that matters to me is I know that a man is a man and a woman is a woman. That's it. Except you can't define what a man and a woman are to me. You haven't been able to do that. I have. When I asked you what a woman, when I asked you what makes you a woman, you said, I don't know, I just am. So you can't. There you. I just am. I just am. I just am a woman. I don't. I couldn't. I can't define it. But I just am. I just am. And then when a trans person says I'm a woman because I just am, you get upset about that because you think it makes you. You think it's no, it makes you less. My, no, because the part there's a part in my brain that goes, okay, but you don't like you. You don't have the same stuff. Like oh, parts as I do. Like, there's I a part in your brain that tells you you're a woman. So this this thing in your brain that identifies your gender, um, yeah, it's it's a thing in your brain that specifically identifies what your gender is. Man, what would we call that? Like a like some sort of gender identity, right? There's some no, sort of like gender identity in your brain like that. that connects you to your gen. That's crazy. Like that. Wow, who would have I seen that coming? Yeah, the sex part. I'm talking about that part. The sex part. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. What part of our brain is the sex part? Um, I'm talking about the, the, the anatomy of the body. You said there's the a thing in your brain that tells you what gender you are, and it's the sex part. Yeah, it's telling me that this this person, this man here with a ooh-ooh uh, is telling me there's a woman. My brain's saying, well, no, you're not. So, yes, because your brain, you your brain doesn't understand the difference between sex and gender. No, I believe gender is just this wishy-washy thing, so. I believe gender is just a wishy-washy. Yeah, so, mean, why, so why do I you call yourself a woman if gender is wishy-washy? Oh, my God, because I have the, the sex character. I have everything that makes a woman a woman. <laughs> What's a woman? I just told you I have everything. No, what is sex a woman? I just told you the sex characteristics, so vagina, the mm -hmm. stuff that you, I can give birth, all of that. So stuff. a woman has to have a vagina to be a woman. Yeah, that's kind of like all of those things. Oh, okay. Yeah. So a woman born without that, without a vagina, would be what? <sighs> a woman. Oh, but you just said women have to have vaginas. Yeah, but it's probably just an abnormality. So women have to have vaginas unless they don't have vaginas, in which case they're still women. I don't, I don't know of like what you're talking about in case they don't. I don't know what, what this stuff is. But mm -hmm. <sighs> so women have to have vaginas unless women don't have vaginas. Got it. Yeah, and the give birth and all that yep. stuff. Oh, women have yeah. to give birth. Oh, um, yeah. Like, so I know some some women like have troubles of it and stuff like that but you know they've got all this the oh so women don't have that. to give birth i'm just saying i'm just saying i know i'm not trying to be like uh, uh what's the word yeah i'm just trying to figure out do women need these things or do they not need these things because in one breath you say they need these things and then the ne next breath you said they don't need these things so which is it they, 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 they're born like they're born to have these things, but sometimes people have like abnormalities. So then they don't need these things. No, abnorm they just have abnormalities of what 
of what they sh they should have had or what has went wrong, basically. So, like I said, they don't need these things. These things would not be a need. Hmm. I'm just saying, like, yeah, well, I just believe sex. The, uh, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, I just want to keep it like to biology. So. You you equate sex to biology, so do the rest of us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and yeah, so yeah, okay, cool. We agree, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no one's ever disagreed that sex is a biological thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's what makes them woman or man. So. Okay, so a woman just has to be anything that's female? Oh, I just wasn't expected to get, like, ridiculed like this. Oh, I wasn't uh, expecting yeah. you to say dumb things. No, I don't think what I said was dumb. I just think you, you oh, just I kind do. of... That's okay, then. Whatever. Believe what you want. But I... I'm going to. It, it, does, it does say it does say, say something about the way that this, this, arg this arg the argument always ends up being, like, anyone who doesn't believe... And this stuff. I have had about. I have had so many debates about this topic yeah. that don't end in me belittling somebody. Do you know why? Because they don't no, say no, stupid no, shit. You, they don't. They don't, so they don't. they don't contradict themselves. They don't contradict themselves all the time. Like, they don't say. The they don't. Opinion. They don't toss the most privileged. They don't God, toss the most privileged idiot, fucking. I don't listen. Stuff. If you can't handle being called a name, go that's, somewhere else. That's what being mean is. Whoop, like, whoop, whoop, did I ever claim to be nice? Did I ever claim to be nice? Yeah, and I'm have I ever I made that claim? Uh, 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 no, you've never made that claim. Okay. But it, does prove, it does prove something about this <laughs> argument. Whoop de doo. Whoopee. I'm not going to be nice to somebody that uses bigoted language. I don't care. No, I, I'm, well, I don't think I said somebody calls me all of this stuff for having a different of opinion. That's quite sad. It's not a difference of opinion. You've had bigoted language this whole time. Just accept it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm like, not Except it. that you've said bigoted shit. You will not dictate who I am as a person. You will I'm, not make me feel. You I, will not make me feel <laughs> however you'd like to make me feel. I will not whatever. make you feel however, but you can make trans people feel however, and that's fine. Got it. Got it. Terrible. Yeah. It's, like it's, 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 it's terrible when you get to, when you experience this, opinion. but when a trans when person does it, wow. Opinion. Well, you when, are basically uh -huh. saying if I do not subscribe to the ideas of what trans people believe, then I am an awful person. That's literally what you're saying, and that's not fair. I'm saying if that you base your fair. bigoted nonsense, fair. I'm saying if you base your bigoted nonsense around fucking bigoted. bunk science like you've been doing. No. Yes, yes. And the reason you keep interrupting me right now is because you know if I explain this all to everybody, they're all going to see you're, that you're a bigot. But you don't want them to, so so that's why every time I go to talk, Jeez. you you try to talk Jeez. over me. He wants to send the whole world against me, Jesus. Yes, wow. that's what's happening. That's what happened. The victim you complex on you is crazy. The, you, now you, the now victim, you want the victim complex. The I, I haven't said anything about chat. The victim complex on you is crazy. You, the it's it's wild. No, the, too, I've never seen about? I've never seen Darvo so himself. brilliantly expressed oh, until right think? now. No one's contradicting me, like stupid. Nobody's you contradicting. Said, I'm not talking to chat. I haven't mentioned chat. Point, it, it, I don't care what the chat thing. I, I don't care what other people I don't. think. Sh Next thing, you're, thing, you're getting everyone to agree with you and, and come on me. Who's who's saying what? I want everyone to agree with me? When did right. I say that? When you did I say that? that? When did I say it? When did I say it? When did I say it? Oh, when did I say it? When did I say? When did I say I want everyone to agree with me? When did I say it? 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 Go ahead. Then, Go ahead. When did I say it? Tell me. Tell me, and I this. quote exactly what I said. I I know I know I, I yeah I, quote I, exactly I, what I said. No, you have literally like uh huh quote exactly what I said. Where's fighting for my own sanity? Right uh huh now. quote exactly what I said. Bro, you want everyone to be against me? That's quote okay. Quote exactly what I said. That's normally how it goes on you are a things. you are a fucking you are a victim you're trying to victim blame victim like you have this victim yeah, complex victim. sorry you have this victim complex and you're trying to do what all white women do and cry that you're fucking what? oh i'm so 
I'm so vi- I'm yes, so hurt here happened. because all these people. I'm so hurt, and you're trying to send all these people against me for the Let shit that I said. I said it, but you're trying to send people against me for the stuff that I said. Oh my god, I don't care. Yeah, yeah. I don't care. Okay then. I could care less. You yeah, said some stupid shit. shit. You got called out for saying stupid shit, and now you're gonna be I upset that you got called out for saying stupid shit. Well, maybe I'm don't say stupid shit. Aggressive. I don't aggressive. care. I don't care if I'm aggressive. Mm-hmm. The fuck does that matter? Darn it, darn. Yeah. What is? I'm sorry. What does me being aggressive matter? What's it? What's it matter? Also, being aggressive is not a good. What thing. is it? What does it matter? You're being. What do you mean? What, what is it? does oh, it be a matter? If we'll find... Fun fact. Okay. Let's say. Let I have a water bottle right here. Right. If I quietly mm. whisper to you, I have a water bottle. Or if I yell, I have a water bottle. Does it matter? Does the water bottle still exist? Oh yes. God, it doesn't matter how I say something. You're just trying no. to use every microaggression in the book to try to paint yourself as the victim here. It doesn't what work. Yes. Calling, calling, fun you. fact, fun fact. It is very, <laughs> mi- there's a, it is very, mi- it is such a microaggression to call black people aggressive. Just FYI. Especially when I'm not being aggressive. I'm just giving you back the same energy you gave, which was you were a bigot and said bigoted shit. Deal with it. Suck it up and move on. Or be a child. I don't care which one you want to do. Oh my god, did I mute myself? I'm so confused. No, God um, muted you. Oh, really? Okay, before I leave, I, I don't like how this has turned out, but I, I don't would care. say I okay, that's fine, that's fine. I would say one one thing though. The theme that I've tried to go throughout this is that we have a different end of it. Nah. <laughs> no thanks. Nah. You waited days. You ch- I cuz you've been trying to get in my life for days and like that's how you do it. Like get the fuck out of here, please.